Hello guys, today we are seeing uh, another dumping trailer for China domestic market. As you can see, we do the Chinese character, that's our Chinese brand for the dumping trailer. We have a different brand for different type of trailers. And uh, Grease Bear is, uh, that's uh, the meaning of those uh, brands. That's for the dumping trailer because we need uh, the trailer is as strong as the bear. So, same as other rear dumping trailer, we have the hoist system in the front. We haven't installed the, the oil tank in the front, hydraulic oil tank in the front yet, but we have the hydraulic cylinder here. We have the air connection line. This is control line. This is a supply line. And this is a red, and this is a yellow. Let's see. This here, this is yellow, and that's red. Okay, and uh, that's a electricity connection, ABS connection. We haven't installed the ABS light yet. And we also have the indicator in Chinese here to show how it looks like and how, how should we do the maintenance if we have a problem. How do we do the uh, how do we do the repairing? And we use a lot of a boat to fasten those uh, hydraulic uh, cylinder, the dumping body. This is the front wall. We also have a, a bar here for the hose, hydraulic hose in the future. This is uh, the number of the production uh, for this trailer in our factory. And we also have a ladder, ladder here, for the people to climb, for the driver to climb to the top, to fasten the trampolines or the canvas to see the cargo inside. At the bottom, we have the 90 millimeter kin pin, bolted type, to connect uh, the tractor. And we also have the maintenance hole here. So if you have any repairing you need to do, you don't have to, you know, you don't have to remove all this stuff. You just need to check here. You can have the braking line here, hydraulic cylinder at the bottom, and braking line over there. Where the electricity line? Electricity line goes there, right? Okay. And yeah, cheap landing gear, double side operation again. Because in China, we explained this many times, I'm gonna explain it again. We do not do the separation, the semi-trailer and the tractor very usual. They usually hook up the tractor and they never separate them. So they use a very cheap landing gear for the license. We put a toolbox in the middle. The toolbox here, open. Open here, the left and right, and uh, it's very beautiful. We have the lock over there, you can lock it, and uh, this is the key. Once your driver have the problem, you can have uh, you can change the lock this way. All right, Let's close it. Very easy to operate it. Okay, and here the locking device. We use those uh, rubber seal to protect uh, it from the rain water or the dirty water on the road. This is the handle. We install those uh, two box uh, in the left and right uh, May frame. This is the May frame. You can see it's pretty strong and pretty high. And now. We can see the bottom of the trailer with the braking line and braking chamber. Oh, we can see the leaf spring in the front. It's quite unusual because this trailer is quite short. Let's go to the outside. Here is a very, <laughs> very short side protection. And the landing gear right to left in, by Chinese character. There's a three axle in the rear. Now we are looking the side wall of the trailer. It looks like this. Beautiful, isn't it? I'm a pretty impressed by this uh, type of design. 
because uh, it's like a man type tank. Actually, any, any dumping trailer looks like a tank, but this one looks like a very strong and a very powerful tank. It can carry a lot of cargoes, different cargoes you can put inside. And those are the advertisement uh, word for our brand. We have uh, um, writing, this is a pretty strong dumping trailer. And uh, this is our brand. And this is our checking, checking uh, logo. Uh, this is how we do the painting and the coating and how this painting is uh, reliable longer. This is how we're using the steel. And we have those, uh, well, we also have this uh, sign to show you from here to here, the height of the side wall is 600 millimeter. And on the top, you can easily see it's about one meter. So the side wall is about 1.6 meter. In the rear door, we have the left and right open like a container doors. And it can also dump in from the rear, but you can also open it if you, if you don't want to tape in it. So if, it, or if you have a taping hoist system problem, you can open the door and put your employee inside. Use the shovel or forklift to dump the things. But if you are dumping, here we have the locking device. It will lock all the time when the trailer is not taping up. So when the trailer is, goes, is going up and this one is going to be pulled open by this chain fastened to here. So it's an automatic lock by dumping. There are four locking bars. Uh, let me go further so you can see more clear. There are four bars, two in the left, two in the right. So you need to open the right one first, the same as the container. When the right door open, you can open the left door. We also put the reflector tape around the rail, around the beams, so you can easily see it when you are driving another car. We have the rear protection here and our, our mark protection and uh, mark guard. This is our tire. We have the axle protection at the factory. So we protect our own brand axle. It's actually upside down, okay? Let's see here. Yeah, now it's a gross bear by Chinese. It's the same Fuhua, de Fuhua design axle. Uh, the tire we're using is uh, Chaoyang, which uh, the English brand name is Westlake. That's pretty, pretty weird. <laughs> they have a different Chinese name and uh, the English brand name. Okay, we, we are using the... Sorry about the noise, they are pulling the... I'm finished the low back trailer through the... Way, so we have to wait until the pass by. Anyway, the weight of the trailer is about three meters, so it's quite uh, dangerous. Okay, let's uh, go back see the. Now the low bed has uh, gone, so we can keep seeing here. Behind the chain is. Uh, the rotation device, rotation pins, usually they only have the two pins for each trailer. We do not uh, trust the two pins because we need two more in the middle. So this is uh, much stronger than the two pins one. We have uh, four pins. Here we can see the protection, mark protection guard made by the aluminum and uh, mounted to the maybe this is the May beam, this is the dumping body. Uh, how could we go to the bottom to see? Uh, we cannot, it's quite narrow. Okay, uh, we can see from here. It's not clear, let me find a way in. We can see the bottom from here. Okay, you can see the red line is the, is the line, the nylon tube is not shaking with the trailer, so we use the nylon tube because it's not shaking with the trailer. It's always like this way. But we're using the rubber hose to contact the braking valve because it's moving moving with the axle. When the axle goes to the bumping road, it's moving like this. 
That's why I need to have the have the nylon tube like that. And here we can see the leaf spring, and we have the special leaf spring for the jumping trailer. It's four four lengths leaf spring, and only four pieces. And that's the ABS sensor line. And here, it's always have this to protect the awareness of this boat. And this is how the trailer being reinforced in the between the two left and right main beam. In China market, we do use the automatic slight adjuster like this one, and which is not necessary for other market because that's uh, more expensive. Now here is the, the label for the axle, where it made it. All right, this is a license, license plate light. And this is the rear light. And let's open the door and have a look uh, at inside. The door open, you can see you need to open the right door first and then you can have the left door open after then, we have the reinforcement bar in the rear to reinforce reinforce the bottom the bottom side walls, and we also have the connections for the top wall and the bottom wall here. And that's that's uh, another rear wall. If you are if you are removing all those top walls, you can have the special dumping walls at the rear and remove this left and right walls specially made for our client. And in the front you can see we have the connections for the hoisting system and uh, the letters. People can go to the top by those uh, letters. All right, that's uh, how it looks inside. And let's close the door. Door has been closed. Okay, we need to close this one. Close this one. We need to close this first. Okay, and then we need to close this one. You can see we made it quite easy. You can operate it uh, by just the one hand. All right, I think that's. Uh, all the things we need to say for this trailer. It looks like a really like a tank. Thank you guys. If you have any comments, please uh, leave uh, below. Sorry for the noise because uh, it's the working time. Our new production line is uh, start to work now. See you guys next time and uh, thank you. Bye.